Hi there and welcome to ChatGPT 4.0. Let me accept all. Now notice here, free. Limited access to GPT 4.0. So let's uh, start and get an account. So here we are. Uh, we are going to sign up. Okay, so I've joined. I have a free account here with my university, one of my university's emails. And um, notice it says new here and our fastest and most affordable. So there is a price, even though it did say free. So um, let's go back. We don't want to pay for 4.0 since it mentioned that it was going to be free. So if you say it, uh, that's what we want. So we're in, okay, let's go uh, explore GPT so we can do that for free. Notice um, it says that. So let's continue with try it now. All right, so notice um, we can explore various um, GPTs and they're all free, of course. Let's find some that I created. Nelly Deutsch. There are different ways of searching for them. Okay, so these are my seven GPTs and you can try them. There's the WebQuest wizard. Notice um, it's available for free and that's wonderful. Let's go back to ChatGPT. So I know I'm on 4.0. Okay, notice um, there's also the Chad GPT plus, um, but this is great for every day. And I get a chance to use the GPTs if I'm teaching English as a foreign language or to other speakers. I can get TESOL guide, for example, TESOL business guide from Brazil. And you can see who created them, either individuals or organizations. There are more if you go into the more. So for the under the TESOL guide, you can see what's available here. What are the latest TESOL methodologies and so on. So you're getting all of this, which is super important. Let me know if you have any questions about um, ChatGPT 4.0 and exploring the GPTs, which is what it is all about. Thank you for watching. Questions? in the comment box below.